Hello, my name is Karen Chapman. I'm one of the ophthalmology technicians here at Texas A&M at the vet school. And um, I'm actually an LVT. I got my certification back in 2007 from Tomball College and worked in private practice for a while. And now I'm here at A&M. And um, would you like to go ahead and introduce oh, yourself? Oh, sure. My name is Heather Barnett. I am the floor tech for medicine. I go to all services and help. And I started as a kennel tech and worked my way up. And that's how I got here today. All right, and we're going to be demonstrating how to give um, a patient ophthalmic drops today. We'll be going over all the steps, and so if you'll just follow along with us, we'll go through this. So the technician is going to examine the animal for presence of discharge. If she notes any discharge, she will either use a cotton ball or a gauze sponge to wipe it away. She will gently wipe away any discharge from the patient's eye. The technician is now going to open the ophthalmic medication prior to opening the eyelids. She is going to make sure she understands the amount of medication to give. After she opens the medication, she's going to place the cap on a clean surface. The student is going to use her non-dominant hand, so that way she can use her dominant hand to give the, the medication. She's going to use her thumb to pull down the lower lid and her index finger to lift up the upper lid. Once she has that ready with her medication in the dominant hand, she's going to put her dominant hand on the patient's head, hold the medication at least an inch above the eye to prevent the dog from wiggling and poking itself. She's not going to touch the dispenser to the eye or surrounding hair, and she's going to make sure she gives the correct amount of drop or applies the proper amount of ointment. She released the eyelids, and she allowed the dog to blink in order to move the medication throughout the eye. <laughs> 